Right, well that's another unexpected result. That's, uh, that's the one benefit of having a bizarre game. It's uh, easy to surprise people in it, I guess. Hello? There we go. Well that just figures. I have a minimal amount of control here. Hello? Alright, we're down to one brother here. Uh, I do need to take a side note and say this is a really sweet looking tree. Uh, it's like a weeping willow, but just all white and awesome. Uh, what was... oh man, I meant to go check that little hole there at the beginning. But uh, we have a mission. Not exactly sure. Oh wait, is this the tree that we've been trying to get to? I vaguely remember, like we were supposed to get some kind of like a root thing. That's why we originally came. So is this was this the final goal? Are we about to hit the end of the game? So, something else I have yet to mention while playing this game. I really enjoy the music. A lot of people don't talk about audio whenever they're playing a game. It's a very important thing. And the music in this game I thought was pretty good. Some of the sounds aren't like great, but they're better than some games. Hello? Oh great, it's a nest. Something belongs in that nest. And that's probably gonna be our final obstacle. Well, one of them. This game always throws a surprise at you. Alright, so we're here for the water that's in the tree. Right. I guess, maybe? I think? Alright, well I guess that first hole just, this is going to lead to that hole I was talking about before. We'll just slide down. Fair enough.
Well, if I can say one thing immediately, that's pretty impressive holy dog with just his hands. I had to throw a sad point here at the end of the game, didn't I? Couldn't have just been a happy ending. I don't know what to say right now. This is depressing. I can say another good thing. Um, it's a pretty sweet spot to be buried, if nothing else. Got this awesome looking tree. I've always liked weeping willows, and this tree kind of reminds me of one. Except cooler. Um, that's all I got right now. Um, seriously? So let's hope that the water doesn't take effect here at the very end turn him into some kind of like zombie guy. Uh, that would be most unfortunate. Ah, jeez. I know, kid. Let's just try and pick up the pace. Get it over with. Almost. There we go. Surely that's not the same owl rat ripping thing as before. But I guess that explains uh, what the nest was about. Maybe something had to live there. Right. Well, almost there. 
I'm waiting for some final loop to be thrown by this game because they keep doing it, keep doing things that I, I half predict but don't quite. Like the one lady, uh, she wasn't a spider or she wasn't a vampire, she was a spider. Close enough. I'm expecting another loop to be thrown here. Maybe it'll be as simple as walking. Why couldn't that Griffin thing have dropped us off up at the top? Saved us all this trouble, running through the rain, getting our pants dirty, whatever. Maybe, oh crap, have you learned to swim after all this? You spent all that time out there, this is like the one thing you should have learned by now. Okay, I've had some encouragement from Ghost Mom. We can do this. We can swim. You can do it, man. Get in that water. He doesn't want to do it. Get in the water. Come on, man. What am I supposed to do here? He doesn't want to do it. He says no. Oh, come on. I'm confused. Are we supposed to backtrack here? Hello? Well, we, we can't go any further back. Why? Why doesn't he want to get in the water? Is there really anything else to interact with here? Come on, guy. Let's go. Yes. Um. Ready, set, go. I'm Oh wait. All right. You gotta use the older brother's controls. All right, that was. That's a pretty sweet touch. Okay, just to explain what's going on here. Normally, you only have like two functions for controlling each character. Like, the younger brother is the right, or yeah, the right control stick and trigger. The older brother was the left control stick, which does nothing right now, but the, the left trigger goes into like older brother mode or something. Because <laughs> I'm holding it right now, and that's how I swam. Interesting. Uh, let's quickly go this way. I know we were supposed to go the other way, but I want to see what's over here. It's like pointing me in the right direction. Uh, I want to see if there's like some kind of hidden... Wait, no, this is the way we're supposed to go, isn't it? This was a thing.
weird. All right. Um. All right. Let's take care of this. Wait, what? Wait, it wants us to go the other way, I think. And I'm not sure why. This is our house. But I shall comply. There's something else the game wants us to see. Don't worry, we'll use Older Brother Mode. Fantastic. And I guess we'll just use Older Brother Strength to just jump on up there. Unless we can... Okay. We'll do it this way. Parkour. There we go. And let's see, we're going into town. Oh wait, no. This is like the doctor guy? Okay, yeah. Notice he stacked some stones there. Bit of a... I don't know if that's Norse or Celtic. I know Indians, Native Americans did that. Not sure. This game has had a general Norse Celtic kind of feel to it, which I can dig. Uh, so I, I recognized that. Oh, we don't have older brother vision anymore. Oh. Papa figures up over here. Go say hello. I, didn't, I mean, I guess I knew the game was close to an end. I guess I forgot though. There you go. Brothers, A Tale of Two Sons. I gotta say, uh, that was a pretty fun game. I quite enjoyed the over... It took a kind of a generic storyline and made it unique, changed it up, 
and uh, made it a whole kind of weird, different th sort of thing. Uh, I can really respect what they did with this game, start to finish. Uh, it was generally a sad game, but I mean, it was. I enjoyed playing it. I hope you guys enjoyed half as much watching it as I did playing it. Um, if you can take one life lesson out of this game, I think it would be if you ever run across a cult uh, sacrificing a lady, don't save her. That's uh, that's the life lesson of this game. I'm pretty sure. If it's something else, um, I've misinterpreted the whole story, I think. <laughs> but, like I said, hope you guys have enjoyed it. Uh, if you did, you want to play through it yourself, maybe there's some uh, side stuff that I missed. I definitely recommend picking it up, even though you've watched me just play the whole thing. It is a good game. I'm not sure if these guys have made any other games. I haven't really looked. Um, maybe I will. But uh, I'm going to let the credits play through. But uh, from here on, uh, I'm going to let it... Yeah, I'm just going to let the credits play through. And uh, I'll catch you guys next time. Thanks for watching. I'll see you later.